Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to The Breakdown. Today I'm gonna quickly show you how to make a watermark preset in Photoshop. This is gonna save you a ton of time when you're editing a large amount of photos at once. So let's go ahead and get started. The first thing we need to do is create a new document. Now what I recommend doing is making a document about 3000 by 3000. If that's too big of a document for you to work in, make something a little bit smaller. Uh, the resolution of this doesn't really matter because we're going to define a brush from this. So what we need to do, grab our text tool or create an icon if that's what you're looking for, for your watermark. However, for this, I'm just going to use simple text and we're just going to type patrickfastler.com and we can go ahead, resize the text and then we can move it to the center of the page. It doesn't really matter how large the text is. It doesn't really matter if there's a ton of unused space because what we're going to do is just turn that background off. The only reason I recommended making a 3000 by 3000 document is if you are working with an icon trying to make a watermark out of an icon or a picture, this makes it a lot easier to work with. Now what we're going to do is very simple. Come up here and then click on define brush preset. And now we're going to have to name the brush so we'll just name it watermark click OK or enter or return on your keyboard, whatever you're using, and then go back to the image that you want to add the watermark to. So once you have that done, just come over to the image that you want to add the watermark to, add a new layer, you don't have to name the layer or you can name the layer, it's whatever you want to do, and then we can simply come over here, make the brush a little bit bigger by hitting the uh, brackets on your keyboard, and then you can just click anywhere in the photo to add the watermark and there you have it it saved you a ton of time especially when you're working on a lot of photos at once you can go ahead and turn the opacity down to make it a little less obtrusive in the photo so I'll just set it down to about 15 percent and there you have it you have a watermark preset you can go into any of your images and just add watermarks anywhere you want to add watermarks so thanks for watching this video guys I hope you enjoyed if you did leave a thumbs up also subscribe to the channel for more content like this and if you have any suggestions for Photoshop tutorials go ahead and leave those down in the comment section below and we'll be sure to do them thanks for watching guys and I will see you next time